<laughs> oh my goodness, friends. So many things. So many things. So, uh, for a long time, HubSpot didn't have a fiscal year setting, right? And then you all said we want a fiscal year setting. So we put a fiscal year setting in there. I, over the course of the issue, I've become uh, aware of the fact that it doesn't do a lot. Uh, some of you have been like, how do I set goals on the fiscal year? How do I forecast on the fiscal year? And I've always been like, just set fiscal year and doesn't work. And you've been like, no, Kyle, it doesn't. Well, now it does. So check this out. Here I am in my account defaults. And um, I'm going to set my fiscal year to something random. June to May, how about? And we're going to save that. And now uh, check this out. If we go over to sales and we go to forecast, look, when we're forecasting, we have fiscal quarters and fiscal years as options and it knows what they are awesome so that's forecasting super simple now check out goals check out goals and this is this is what i'm really excited about so i came in to the goals section to um to make sure that you know fiscal year actually works here and it does look if we create a goal we'll do from a template we'll call it this catchy name and we'll do it on revenue and we'll come over here and look just by default just by default, it goes straight to fiscal year. And if you don't like that, you can go to your setting and change your fiscal year. Um, and you can choose, you know, what which year you're choosing. Um, so awesome. Fiscal year works just as advertised, just as you would expect it to work. Great. Do you notice anything interesting about this page? Anything else jump out to you? What is this up here? Do you intend to forecast for this goal? Yes, create forecast for this goal and view in reporting. Or no, create team goals with multiple pipelines and yearly milestones. What? Can we just explore this for a minute? Look, we can select users and teams. We can choose our, our monthly, quarterly, yearly duration, whatever. Um, let's uh, let's just assign it here. Yep, great. And then look, look, we can select multiple pipelines. If you want to set a goal that looks across all your different pipelines instead of just being tied to one, you can totally do that now. Whoa, so, so much. Like I said, so much. Fiscal year now actually does all the stuff you wanted it to do in forecasting and in goals. And in goals, apparently... You can select multiple pipelines to forecast across or set goals on. Anyway, Christmas came early. Uh, I don't know if your fiscal year is ending now or if it's sometime other. But anyway, it all just works now. So check this out. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any questions.